good morning everyone this is seeking sustainability live and today we are talking with ran nomura and rika fujiwara in hiroshima is helping with language a little bit so ran is a influencer on instagram she is very active on social media promoting the zero waste lifestyle in japan and we're gonna learn more about how she got started and all the different tips and advice that she has for us to make living and working in Japan a little bit less of an impact on our environment. Thank you so much for joining Ran and Rika. Hi. Now I <laughs> want to introduce Rika first. Rika was helping me last year in Hiroshima uh, when we were doing a Seeking Sustainability event and Rika is very uh, knowledgeable about aromatherapy. She's an aroma care nurse and she taught us how to make DIY soaps. So I knew Rika would be the perfect person to help with language today if we need a little bit of translation help. Thank you so much, Rika. Okay, it's my pleasure. <laughs> so Rand, let's start with a little mm -hmm. bit about how your journey for zero waste began. How did you get interested in the zero waste lifestyle? Uh, eh to, in Japanese, okay? Uh, eh to, ze, あの, 4 years ago, I read Zero Waste Home という本を読んで Zero Waste の生活を始めました Okay, can I translate okay. each sentence? Yeah. Each, each? Okay. Uh, okay. I started... Uh, doing something related to zero waste things after I read I read the book about the zero waste home four years ago. That was the beginning. えっと、自分の出すゴミが、あの、環境に悪影響を与えてしまっていることとか、あの、地球の環境問題について、いろいろすることができて、そこからもうすぐに始めてみようと思いました。Okay, but uh, after she read the book, she started to think about the eco-friendly lifestyle. Then just she started to research about it. で、えっと、その後、日本ではもう全然環境問題のことが取り上げられてなくて、周りにも全然ゼロエストをしている人がいなかったんですけれど、えっと、本、本、そのゼロエストホームとあとインスタグラムとか。から海外の情報を得ながら少しずつ生活を変えていきました。There uh, weren't many people around me uh, thinking about the environment or plastic problems. So she just got some information from the books, uh, which is the Jello Waste Home, or she just got the information from the internet. And she gradually got a lot of information from it and think about the eco-flangery lifestyle. ね、あの、自分でも少しずつ生活を変えていくうちに、なんかこれもあの、他の人にシェアしたらいいアイデアじゃないかなっていうのが見つかってきて、それをインスタグラムで発信するようになりました。Okay, so after she got started to think about her lifestyle and started her like eco lifestyle and gradually she thought that it might be good to uh share her tips for lifestyles and then she started the instagram or things like that ね、あの、世界中からすごいいろんな反応やえっとコメントをもらうことができて、なんかそのコメントとかいいねとかそういうのが えっと、励みになって4年ぐらいずっとゼロエス生活を続けています。Okay. Um, after she started the Instagram, she got a lot of comments on her platform, like Instagram. Then she was really encouraged by those comments and uh, 
good good in it <laughs> mm. <laughs> and she can continue uh she can keep her eco lifestyle mm -hmm. yeah that's it <laughs> thank you that's great thank you so much and i'm showing your instagram page right now mm -hmm. um you when did you start your instagram page maybe four or four years ago and you have grown your instagram into a really big following mm -hmm. has it been a surprise that it has grown so much in popularity うん、すごいびっくりしました最初は。あ、最初はでも1年ぐらいはそんなにフォロワーもいなくフォロワーの人もいなくて、なんかちっちゃい規模でやってたんですけど、あのグレタさんとかがあの出てきて環境問題がす
Okay, so how I teach them about the eco lifestyle, I watch the movies or videos or together with my daughters, and also we join the, some kind of meetings together to learn about the sustainability or mm -hmm. eco lifestyle. And also, but still, it's hard mm -hmm. to share my ideas with mm -hmm. my daughters, mm -hmm. but at least they bring their own uh, bottles of mm -hmm. like water or tea with them and they they like wearing the used clothes mm -hmm. secondhand clothes so that's the things that they can do it together and mm -hmm. gradually so まだまだ日本は遅れてしまっていて、こういうゼロウェストとか言うと変だよとか言われて、そうすごい難しいんですけど。They <笑> don't teach about the environmental things at the Japanese schools, so it's difficult to explain to them about it. But and it's way behind, like other to the other countries in all over the world. And if I say something zero waste, and it sounds a little bit weird to other people sometimes. That's so yeah. true. And I'm showing on screen um, the things that I think most of us working mothers connect with struggling to change to zero waste in Japan. And mm -hmm. so for example, laundry. You mm -hmm. were able to switch from the hard plastic laundry container to mm -hmm. a more environmentally friendly, uh, biodegradable type of mm -hmm. detergent mm -hmm. and very natural. And then osechi ryori, which mm -hmm. is a very typical uh, kind of meal that everybody has on New Year's Day as a family. And often there is fish or seafood included, but this year you tried it plant-based. Mm -hmm. And then cleaning, mm -hmm. you know, cleaning products <laughs> often yeah. has a high impact of plastic or damaging chemicals, right? Mm -hmm. And then I was so happy to see the no junk mail sticker. <laughs> And you said your daughter did it. Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> these are the things on Instagram that when I saw it, I thought, wow, you are really impacting your family as oh, really? well as reducing your waste, you know? Um, yeah, has I... there been any pushback, like from mm -hmm. your husband or, or kids? Uh, or slowly they're accepting it. Mm -hmm. I hope so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> そう、<笑> So my husband said that he couldn't stop buying the uh, plastic bottled drinks during summer, especially. And if I talk about, I want to talk about it with my husband, uh, the fight is gonna start. So I can't say to him strongly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, under, I understand that. Um, and in, in my family too, right? Like you don't want your family to struggle. Like mm -hmm. if they're really thirsty and there's only plastic bottles available and they mm -hmm. already drank their suito, of mm -hmm. course you want them to buy a bottle if they need it and there's mm -hmm. no water fountain, right? Um, you don't want them to suffer, mm -hmm. but you want to encourage them to make better choices. And sometimes mm. maybe the husband is the most difficult mm -hmm. uh, more than the children. I don't know. Mm, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's nice to see that also your followers on Instagram were also very receptive to the housewife or the working mother mm -hmm. type of zero waste changes. I think mm -hmm. a lot of people in Japan and around the world are really struggling 
with these factors about mm -hmm. laundry, about cleaning, especially. Mm -hmm. Did mm -hmm. you find that with your followers? うん。すいません。あ、あの、なんか受け入れることが難しい、特に選択とかそういうのがあるみたいですけど、フォロワーさんの中でそういったことってありますか? Is that something that the followers message, right? うん。そうですね。コメントとかで。あ、えっと、ゼロウェストを受け入れるとか難しいってことですか特に選択とかするときにそういうこういうものを使うのが難しいとかなんかそういうことに関する。選択とかあのコメントもらったことないですけど、や
like followers, many followers for Japanese followers. So I decided to uh, not only reading in English, but also sending messages in English. Yeah, it's great. Mm -hmm. um, I'm also really happy to see that you are collaborating with a lot of brands. Mm -hmm. So you're promoting local businesses in Japan, mm -hmm. which are doing sustainable products, for example, mm -hmm. a hotel, which is trying to be zero waste. Um, you are also doing giveaway collaboration with different companies mm -hmm. in Japan and internationally. And mm -hmm. I think this has been very useful for you in mm -hmm. building your following mm -hmm. on Instagram, but also is very useful for your users to be introduced to these brands that they mm -hmm. want to support. Mm -hmm. Can you talk a little bit about um, collaborating with businesses and companies? あの、Okay. Um, at first, I'd like to get some information about the, the companies that produce the sustainable products. Um, um, I couldn't find the, any like homepages or Instagrams that uh, shares the information about the products. Uh, at that time, um, uh, I would like to know about the Japan uh, to the people from all over the world. So I decided to share the information about Japan in English. Yeah, it's uh, you have some giveaways. Um, mm -hmm. Have you found the giveaways has been a very good way to get your audience engaged with uh, trying to learn more about this sustainable product mm -hmm. as well as trying to win? Mm -hmm. um, have you found it very effective on your social media, the giveaways? So, this is company to give away. あの、エンゲージを結構獲得できて、あと、フォロワーの人にもあの、広くその情報を伝えられるので、よくギブアウェイをコラボレートしてます。あ、so、uh, give away kind of system is really helping me to spread the information about the product. So we just I just collaborate with the some companies and give away products just and uh, help me to uh, inform about the product widely. そうですね。なんかこういう <laughs> Okay, I, I also want to uh, support the small business companies that produce the sustainable products. That's one another reason why I do this. It's I think it's a it's a great system and you have a good balance of uh, free information mm -hmm. and free suggestions that mm -hmm. I don't think you're getting any benefit from, but you're visiting them anyway, so you're promoting them. Mm -hmm. But also the giveaways is a more structured style of support from the business to you, but also from you to your user. Mm -hmm. And I, I think you talked about this earlier, how you have to be responsible because your followers trust you. Mm -hmm. So you have to make sure that the brands you're collaborating with mm -hmm. are ethical and sustainable brands. Is mm -hmm. that right? Yeah, yeah. So, 
本当にサステナブルな会社かどうかあの判断するのが難しいんですね。でなんか前間違ってそんなにあのグリーンウォッシュな会社とギブアウェイしてしまってでそれからはあのイギリスの,あの、えっと、サステナブルインフルエンサー用の,あの、えっと、カンパニーがあるんですけれどそこに所属してそこの人のおすすめの,あの本当にサステナブルな会社とギブアウェイするようにしています最近は。<笑> So,、um, at first, I had a kind of bad experience with the not a good company. And、uh, I cannot tell whether the company is doing really ethical and the sustainable things. So, I started to talk with the people in England at the company, and which pro- provide the information about the sustainability company. Sustainable companies? I think communication, clear communication and research、uh-huh. before you take on a collaborative project is so important in,、uh-huh. in terms of、uh, protecting your brand as,、uh-huh. as someone that people trust, right?、Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, and I think you're doing, you're doing a great job. All the brands that you collaborate with, I'm so happy to see promoted here.、Mm-hmm. Um, a lot of companies, small businesses in Japan, making、mm-hmm. handmade things or making local products, but also、mm-hmm. uh, international companies which are doing products we don't have、mm-hmm. yet in Japan,、mm-hmm. right?、Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I think this is very important for sustainable businesses in Japan、mm-hmm. to have a balance. Of imported products we don't have yet, but we、mm-hmm. want, and local products which may be not perfectly zero waste, but、mm-hmm. it's local and、mm-hmm. it's a good product, right?、Mm-hmm. Do you find you're trying to get that balance as well? So, this is it. 海外から輸入するのと日本のローカルのものを使うのとどっちがいいかってことですよね。なんかそのバランス。<笑>どう,どう思いますかどうやってますかとかどう思いますかす、ねえっと、できるだけプラスチックが使われててもローカルなものをまず優先して使ってどうしても日本にないものはあの海外のものを使ってみたりするようにしています。<笑> Uh, I tried and find the local products at first. And if I cannot find them in my area or local area, I just import from, the, from abroad.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I think many people who are trying to have a zero waste,、uh, more sustainable lifestyle are having similar struggle, right?、Mm-hmm. Like, I want to promote local businesses, but it's not quite as good. Mm-hmm. As the international business, we can also import to Japan.、Mm-hmm. So, of course, the future goal is、mm-hmm. that all these amazing sustainable zero waste products are、mm-hmm. in Japan, local,、mm-hmm. and we can have our own products to promote.、Uh, mm-hmm. For example, you have a giveaway with a kimono uh, uh, yeah. sense sachet、mm-hmm. maker. Yeah. So, beautiful upcycled product, very、mm-hmm. locally made, handcrafted.、Mm-hmm. Um, you also have a local tea、uh, business in、mm-hmm. Miyazaki, I believe, making、uh, yeah. beautiful matcha. So, these are two very nice local companies、um, you've、mm-hmm. worked with. But you also have shoemakers、um, from abroad who、mm-hmm. can ship to Japan.、Mm-hmm. We don't have Sustainable shoes like that、no. in Japan yet,、mm-hmm. right? So、yeah. I, I love this balance that you're doing.、Mm-hmm. You're doing a really good job.、Ah, thank you so much. But I always have a lot of trouble. I have a lot of plastic in my pocket. I have a lot of plastic in my pocket. I have a lot of plastic in my pocket. I often have、uh, struggled with the things that I should I use the local products that are wrapped with the plastic things or should I import the products from foreign countries? <laughs> It is always a struggle. Every、mm. time, right? I'm thinking so much every time I go shopping,、mm. every time I, I look online, right? 
Uh, but you, thanks to you, uh, your users have a lot of great examples of mm -hmm. what they can look for. Um, I loved your reel visiting the first zero waste supermarket in Japan. Mm. That's very exciting news. Can you tell mm -hmm. us about it? Uh, so, 先月、京都にできたゼロウェストスーパーマーケットなんですけど、あの、すべてのものが、あの、量り売りで販売されてます。で、あの、量り売り用の容器も、あの、海外ではプラスチックを使ってるところが多いんですけど、それも全部、あの、ガラスとか木材とかでできているそうです。で、あの、量り売り用のワゴンとかもあったりとか、あと、えー、っとあのはか今映ってるはかりなんですけどそれもすごいテクノロジーが駆使されていて、あのー、簡単にはかり売りで買い物できるようになっててとても素敵なところでした。Okay. I visited the one shop、uh, which is in Kyoto last month and you can get the food or products by weight or measures and、uh, the container that you use when you go shopping there Are all like wooden or、uh, glasses.、Uh, and they use the really high technology, high tech、uh, measure.、Mm. And you, you can buy shopping, you can shop it really easily.、Mm. There. Isn't, it, isn't it interesting how so many of the products that you can buy bulk in the zero waste shops? Mm -hmm. Are only imported products, right? Like、mm, nuts yeah, yeah. and coffee and、cereal. chocolate and yeah, cereal. Yeah, yeah. And but, I, I look at them and I want to buy them, but why are they all imports, right?、Mm -hmm. But sometimes you also introduce, for example, a tofu maker、mm -hmm. that you can do zero waste. And、yeah. that is so popular because、mm -hmm. I think everybody in Japan is、mm -hmm. looking for. Local products which、mm -hmm. are also zero waste, but they're、mm -hmm. more difficult to、mm -hmm. find, right?、Mm -hmm. Any comment? No comment. Nanka, Dajo, this car. Say, what's how they guys tell me? Nanka, Otto, food, Yasanto, come so that she saw you called zero product. ゼロウェイストでお買い物できるところがすごく少ないので大変です、うんうん、日本では、うん、あそうですねでもあの昔ながらのそういうお豆腐屋さんとか、えっと、野菜屋さんあ八百屋さんとかあと昔のお店ではたまにこうやってプラスチックフリーで売ってるところがあるのであの周りにゼロウェイストショップがなくてもちょっと探してみたらあるかもしれないです。Uh, if you don't have any like zero waste shops around your town, but you still can try and find the shops that were run, run from the old, old, from the old years, and I mean、uh, the old style Japanese shops,、mm. they can sell the tofu without wrapping with the plastic bags. So you can try and find、mm. the local shops.、Mm. I love that. And I love how you do introduce some traditional Japanese style foods or、mm -hmm. wrappings, which are still happening even now in modern Japan. We need to bring these back.、Mm -hmm. I love this natural food wraps in、mm -hmm. Japan、uh, post that you did talking、mm -hmm. about、uh, the leaves that are used to wrap mochi、mm -hmm. or other foods.、Um, it's fantastic to promote. What we have been using traditionally in Japan for many、mm -hmm. years, in hopes that we can use it more, we can、mm -hmm. bring it back, right? So, this is a lot of things that we have been using in Japan for many years. We have been using it in Japan for many years. We have been using it in Japan for many years. We have been using it in Japan for m Yeah, so we have really beautiful, amazing Japanese old style sweets like this, wagashi, or things like that. And they use the leaves, or they, leave, they use their leaves to wrap the mochi, and it looks really great.、Mm -hmm. And I would like to tell to younger people or younger generation about these kind of old traditional Japanese, wonderful.、Mm -hmm. 
things. So, so this is a plastic, もう最近は結構プラスチックの放送に変わってしまってるんですけど、こういう葉っぱの綺麗ですし、世界中の人にもなんか伝えたいなと思ってます。So not only for to the Japanese people, but also I would like to tell about the Japanese traditional things like this to the people all to the all over the world in the all over the world. Yeah, it's wonderful, mm -hmm. and、uh, I I love how you introduce also some products you can buy in the store, like、mm -hmm. certain candies which、yeah. have less plastic wrapping. Like, <laughs> and anybody who loves Japanese candies knows. Botan ame, and、mm -hmm. I used to eat this in Hawaii when I was、oh, really? growing up as a child because we have、really? a lot of Japanese influence. And I remember,、mm -hmm. uh, as you take the candies out,、mm -hmm. uh, it looks like it's in plastic wrapping, but、mm -hmm. it's edible, it's、yeah. made of rice paper, right?、Mm -hmm. And I,、yeah. I love this candy, and you can buy it all over the world, and there's、mm -hmm. less plastic. In, in something that's easily available,、mm. I think this kind of advice is also great.、Mm. そうですね。ボンタオメも昔からあって、プラスチックあまり使われてないんで、なんかたまに買ったりしてるんですけど、うん、こういうなんかキャンディーとかもっと日本だとほとんどプラスチックの個包装になってしまってて、すごいゴミがいっぱい出てしまうので、こういう包装も見直していけたらいいなと思ってます。<笑> This is a kind of,、uh, kind of traditional Japanese sweet candies, and I sometimes have them. And this is really good.、Uh, each, each candy is wrapped in the rice papers, not they don't use the plastic bags, plastic paper. And I would like to introduce these kind of things not only to the Japanese, like young girls, but also to the world. Yeah.、Mm -hmm. And I think, I think the idea, isn't it, in Japan and maybe around the world too, is that if it's wrapped in plastic, it's clean, it's better,、mm. it's, it's new. And the image of things wrapped in plastic being better、mm. is still very strong in Japan.、Mm. So we have to find a way to break, break through that idea and change the idea、mm. and be like, isn't wrapping in a fresh leaf, isn't、mm. that cleaner? <laughs> Or isn't wrapping in my own container、mm -hmm. isn't that cleaner? Like,、mm. let's try to change the perception、mm. of what is cleaner. And I think <laughs> a lot of your posts are very successfully doing that. So, this is a plastic bag of cotton. The more, like, the more, 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 袋に入れた方がいいよとか言われて断るのがすごい難しい時があるんですけど、うん、それは何,何なんでしょうね日本の<笑>なんか文化というか難しいですよねこのゼロウエストの,そのプラスチックを減らしてるっていうのを言っても言ってもまた入れてくれたりとかして<笑>その難しい時があります。うん uh, when I get shopping, the clock sometimes gives me try Uh, and it gives me the plastic bag to protect the food. But I say, no, thank you, not for me. But still, they want to do it. <laughs> it is difficult to refuse their offering sometimes. And I think it's one of the Japanese cultures. Maybe、mm. they, are try, they are trying to be nice. But not the zero waste way. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I think it's connected to the idea of service. And that's why there was so much pushback when the rule happened in Japan to ban the plastic bags, ban the plastic shopping bags. <clears throat> A lot of businesses had the idea that, but giving customers plastic b a g is a kind of service that we offer. So, changing the idea that plastic, giving plastic waste is not a service that、mm. customers want, or sh they should know that it's actually、uh, giving them a burden、mm. that they have to deal with, right?、Mm. Um, so, it's a real mindset shift, isn't it?、Mm. I, I love how you, your advice about taking your own container to the bakery. 
um, mm. and and trying to say no plastic bag, but sometimes mm. they're so fast, mm. right? They just so <laughs> yeah, quickly yeah. put it in. <laughs> and then sometimes when you say no, 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 even the small one, no, no, no <laughs> right? And then they're very confused. But mm. recently, there's more understanding of mm. even the small bags. Oh, you don't want that? And recently, I've been saying, uh, Kotoshi wa plastic kinshi. Mm. Right? Like very simply. <laughs> this is my year of no plastic. I'm so mm. sorry. When I go to the right. And then they're like, oh, Naruhoto, that's interesting. Right? Mm. So what is your strategy? When you go to the stand, are you saying it from the beginning mm. or waiting until they try to get the plastic bag and then saying no, no, no? Do you mm. have a strategy? Mm. Eto. で、何か、えっと、何かこう、お店に行った時に最初からもうプラスチックの私いらないんでって、もう初めに言っちゃうとか、あの、入れようとした時にはプラスチックいいんですって言うとか、なんかそのプラスチックフリーにするためのなんか
mm-hmm. about food and food waste. Mm-hmm. So, so this, right? Mm-hmm. So, あのプラスチックごみも減らしたいんですけど、フードウェストも。フードロスフード食品ロスも減らしたいと思っていてあのできる限り野菜とかも全部食べるようにしててあと皮とかもなんか他のことになんか使えないかなと思って最後まで使うようにしていてあとそれでも残ったものはあの家でコンポストに入れています。I tried the vegetables, all of the parts, like Even the peels or zest, maybe. And I try as much as I can do, but if I cannot use some of them, I put the、uh, them into the、uh, garbage disposal.、Mm, composto. Composto. Is that in English? Yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think compost, yeah, compost is in English and also used in katakana in Japanese, right? Compost.、Mm, uh-huh. Yeah.、Um, so you can see the compost bins、uh, you're using in a cardboard box.、Mm. You're putting your food scraps、yeah. in and, and it becomes dirt, and then you can grow vegetables.、Mm-hmm. You're also using your food scraps to make vinegar. Mm-hmm. And to make cleaners that、mm-hmm. you're using around the house. You're、mm-hmm. so inventive. I love your, your new ideas for ways、um, to reuse the, the waste.、Um, and、uh, yeah, fantastic. But this is not a good idea. It's 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 a good idea. Mm. But doesn't it look more beautiful as well? Yeah, it doesn't matter where you get your ideas. You, you're a great researcher. So,、mm. you mentioned your initial inspiration from B. Johnson from、uh, Zero Waste Home, right?、Mm-hmm. Her book. Yeah. And then you get ideas from other zero waste seeking people in Japan.、Mm-hmm. But because you're combining all of your research、mm-hmm. and re- sharing it to your followers, That's、mm. where your followers can get so much value because、oh. they don't have time to research everywhere.、Mm. They want to just learn it from you.、Mm. So I think be sharing these ideas as you try them,、mm. that's very valuable what you're、mm. doing. So, this is the way to do it. You don't have to do it. You don't have to do it. いろんなゼロウェストアイデアを見つけて試すのが楽しくて自分でとりあえず試してみるんですけどその中で良かったものをなんかまたみんなに伝えたいなと思って発信しています。あ、uh, あ、I research about the zero waste things from the books or maybe home pages and if whenever I find the new things to me, I try them and if there is something that is really good To everybody, I introduce to everybody on my Instagram. I'm going to say, 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 Um, reduce the garbage, and I'm really enjoying the finding out and trying it. it. And I just introduce the information about it, what I've do, been doing.、Yeah. That's awesome.、Mm. I, I think these、uh, three were very popular posts that you did. So, how you transitioned from disposable masks to reusable masks. Mm-hmm. And I think、uh, in the beginning of coronavirus, a lot of people said disposable、mm-hmm. was better. But as time went on, we realized no, the reusable is, is just as good、mm-hmm. and it reduces waste a lot. When I do cleanups every month, I always find disposable masks、mm-hmm. left in the river, left in the, in the ground. It's a、mm-hmm. horrible, horrible thing to pick up. I feel like、mm-hmm. I need like a hazmat suit or something. Mm. Um, it's, but then also, you shared about the cookie cup.、Mm. I've never seen this in Japan, <laughs> but I hope it comes soon. This is very、mm. special. And then,、oh. how to whiten、uh, white socks in a natural、mm. way. 
uh, mm. by boiling, so you don't have to use bleach or chemicals. Mm. So do you want to talk about any of these? Where is it hard to learn how to change? あの、マスクはちょっと最近またあの、コロナが増えてきて難しい場面もあるんですけど、普段ちょっと外出する時ぐらいはあの、ずっと<笑><笑> Same <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> um, I have bad memories. Of. Mm. Um, these days, the COVID new patients, the number of the COVID patients is increasing. So I sometimes have a hard time wearing the reusable masks. But when I go out like in my neighborhood and there are not many people, in that case, I wear the reusable mask. But when I go to the like somewhere, which is really crowded, maybe I wear the disposable one. そうですね。ほとんど、うん、あの、何度も使えるのは使、布のマスクを使ってます。でも、なんか場所によってはやっぱり難しい時もありますよね。うん。It depends on where I go. うん。で、えっと、このクッキーカップは本当にクッキーでできてて、コーヒー飲んだ後に、だ、あん。食べれるんですけど、ゴミが出なくていいなと思って乗せました。大阪にお店があります。すごい。This <笑> uh, cup is made out of cookie, and you can eat this. This is edible, and mm. after you drink up your coffee, you can eat the cup, which is made of cookies, and mm -hmm. you can get this cookie cups in Osaka. Mm. I love that. I, I wanted to come to Hiroshima too. Yeah, I mean, this it, one. It seems perfect, right? You want to go yeah. to the coffee shop, you want to mm. buy something to eat, which is not too filling, and mm. you want to buy a coffee. So why mm. not put them together? Mm. Seems perfect, right? Mm. So you can so, eat and drink at the same time. Yeah. Perfect. And mm. about the white socks? Ah, so this is a very good thing. I'm not sure if I'm going to be a little bit of 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 a little Juice is the baking soda, right? Mm, mm. Okay. Uh, these are the, my daughter's dirty socks. <laughs> now. I don't want to use really strong detergent to wash them out. So I use the baking soda mm. to clean them up. This is something that the from the Japanese old tip. Mm -hmm. Then you just boil with the baking soda mm. and mm. when, when you one. see pictures of old japan or old america or old england mm. they were always boiling their mm. laundry in big pots right stirring the laundry and as a kid i was so confused by that why are they cooking their laundry but it brings out the dirt, right? Mm. It opens up the threads of the material. Mm. If, as long as you have a uh, hardy material like cotton or, or some kind of, you can really beat it, mm. right? Then it works. Um, but yeah, to bring back these old ideas mm. and to reuse the old ideas, mm. if they help us to reduce waste, or to have a more sustainable method, it mm. makes a lot of sense. But I think mm. most young people, they don't know that no. this used to be <laughs> the normal way, right? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I think we have the lot of tips from the old ideas. 
old Japanese ideas, but not only the old Japanese ideas, but also the uh, they have lots of tips from all over the world. So we, I would like to share it with lots of people. Fantastic. Um, one other thing, as we are coming, I kind of feel like it's too hot to talk about Christmas, but <laughs> your Christmas decorations mm. uh, posts were very popular. Uh, mm. So reusing uh, natural materials, mm -hmm. uh, using natural processes to mm -hmm. make decorations mm -hmm. or things to hang around your tree. Mm. Um, that was really popular. Mm. Where did you get some of these ideas about Christmas? あ、そうですね。あの、こんな風にオレンジも干したらあの乾燥するんじゃないかなと思ってそしたらオーブン使わなくてもいいしいいかなと思ってやってみたら成功したのでシェアしましたあの、Okay, um I checked the information on the internet and in in the following country they use the oranges uh they use the oven to dry oranges but I know something, we have something in Japan, which is called hoshigake. Hoshigake is the dried food. Uh, kaki is the persimmons. Mm -hmm. Persimmons. Um, mm -hmm. So we have dried persimmons. We just hang persimmons mm -hmm. at, under the house leaf, mm -hmm. and it becomes dried. Mm -hmm. So I tried to do this, To I tried to do with mm -hmm. the way, and it went well. Mm. Oh, it's great. <laughs> and then it has it has a nice fragrance as well, like mm. a fresh fragrance. Uh, Rika, you're an aromatherapy expert. Mm. I'm sure you use a lot of citrus <laughs> elements, right? Yes. To yes. create a nice atmosphere where people feel more relaxed. So it, mm. yes. it kind of has the, the double effect. Mm. Not only you're reusing something that is natural that you can put in your compost after, but mm -hmm. you're creating a better, healthier atmosphere that makes mm -hmm. you feel like you're having a higher quality lifestyle. And I think mm -hmm. that's so important when you're seeking zero waste. You're not compromising your life. You're not living a less valuable life. Mm -hmm. You're actually enhancing your life, right? Mm -hmm. It's wonderful. I also like this uh, decor with the sticks, and you said mm. in in you made a natural glue, mm. and I think glue making art projects is often mm. a challenge, right? Um, but you made glue using flour and water uh, yeah. instead. Yeah. So this is it. Komugi koto, ano, mizu, ano, de, ano, nori ga, kousaku yo no nori ga tsukureru de. 見つけたので、やってみたら本当にちゃんと使えるのりができて、あのこれを作ってみました。So <笑> I I found about the information on how to make glue with the flour and the water. I was wondering it worked well or not, but it actually did work well. うん。でもなんかすぐあの腐りやすいのですぐ使わないとダメなんですけど、子供の工作とかにはいいなと思いました。uh, the glue goes bad quickly, so we need to use it up soon. But for like kids, I thought it would be good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And isn't that a nice idea? I think as a mother as well, uh, using natural materials, which mm -hmm. have less chemicals, is mm -hmm. also you feel better as a mother uh, mm -hmm. getting your kids to use it, right? Mm -hmm. That you don't have to worry about it being toxic. うん。あの、so even if you eat it, it's no problem, mm. right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think especially for small for small kids, we worry about that. Mm. Um now we have just a few more minutes. I want to introduce uh 
I forgot it again. Hat, heart. Hut. Hut. Yeah. Can you My tell company. us about Hut? This is an interesting business that you're working with, right? Ah, so this is it. It's a hat, an Instagrammer, to, ato, shigoto de, ano, hat, kabushiki gaisa de, ano, web writer, to, ano, henshu no, shigoto o steimas. De, ano, nihon no sustainable na jofo o kai gai ni. あの発信したりとか、あの海外のサスナブルな情報を日本語で発信したりしています。Um, I'm an Instagrammer, as you know,、mm. but not only that, I work for the、uh, company that as a writer and editor, and I introduce the information both in the Japanese and English. Is that right?、Mm. <laughs> Hi.、Wow, so、the company's name is Hard. Hard.、Mm. Hard. Hard. H A R C H. Hard. Hard. So, this is a very sustainable and very sustainable media. I'm going to tell you about it. I'm going to tell you about it. Okay. You, you cannot find any other companies like this.、Um, uh, like... Showing the information about Japan in English. So please check it out.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's wonderful to see that there is more attention、mm-hmm. on sustainability in Japan. And、mm-hmm. of course, social media is a very important part of the process. If we have Poor social media or no social media、mm. about zero waste or about sustainability, we cannot move forward.、Mm. Right? So, what you are doing with your Instagram, with your Facebook, and with your other social media collaborations、mm-hmm. is so important. So,、mm. thank you so much, Ran, for everything、mm-hmm. you're doing and for joining us today and sharing、mm. your insights. Uh, yeah, thank you so much for inviting me. Yeah, I have a good time. Good. Thank, you, thank so you so much. <laughs> And thank you so much, Rika. You did a wonderful、yeah. job with translation. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me here. <laughs> thank you, everybody, for joining. Have a great day. And、uh, see you next time. Take care. Bye. Bye. <laughs>